This is my first time. I wanted to do it last year and I had to work. Uh, I'm a virgin, no pants subway rider. <laughs> There's a first time for everything, even New York's no pants subway ride. On a freezy January afternoon, thousands of people pile into the subway, pull off their pants, and act like nothing strange is going on. All right, so I get out of bed this morning and I can't find any of the pants that look good on me. And I found some really awful looking pants. And I figured, you know what? Like, let's just wear underpants in the subway. For me, it's more of a medical thing. Truth is, a group called Improv Everywhere started this with a few dozen people back in 2002. Now, No Pants Day is a giant coordinated effort to bring spontaneous underpants parties to 44 right, cities and 16 countries. No Pants Subway Ride. <laughs> We should all kind of arrive on the same train, okay? About. Okay. All right, where's the number six train? Say yes! Thank you, buddy. <laughs> Once you've got your pants off, the trick is to act like it's just another day. Of the closing doors, please. Feels freeing. Liberating. <laughs> I feel liberated. <laughs> look around, they're all staring at us weirdly. They look just oh, I love it. Good sight to see. Freedom of expression. <laughs> so, what was your second choice to wear today? Superman tidy whiteies. I don't know. I'm, I like to ride the subway. It gives me exercise getting on and off the trains. <laughs> uh, I'm checking to see if the uh, stations are accessible. I was just carried down two flights of stairs by some wonderful people. Before you put your pants back on, you still have time to party. The New York crowd celebrated at Union Square. Now Lane got no pants on, kid. Why? Pants keeps you warm. It's, it's attacks feminism. It attacks economics. I say invest in pants. 2010. Not pants by choice. Not pants by choice. Each year the party ends with a conga line. You can get dressed before going, but some people figure, what's the point? The press is allowed to come along for the ride if they participate. For Sphere News in New York, I'm Buck Wolf.